What's up, dudes? It's that geeky game with Spirit Miner. Playing through Deadly Memories. Yep. I think it's the one that's set in Neo San Francisco. Something like that. Right, so where we left really? off last time, someone was kidnapped or murdered. We met Turing. Uh, and that was about it. Oh, the person who was kidnapped slash murdered is a friend, I believe. I guess we'll have to go ask. Uh, Kieran's, Turing's so cute. Says here they were going to meet at a club called Stardust, located in the Castro District. I'll mark it on your city map. Cool. We can head over there and ask around about this Tomcat character. Perhaps they can shine some light on why Hayden was snatched. Oh, so it was kidnapped. Okay, cool. Oh, excuse me. I still haven't set up a user account for you in my system. We shouldn't put that off any longer. Once finished, I will have an assortment of new ways to assist you. For example, I'll be able to reroute any call or message that you receive while we're out and about. I just need to ask you a few questions. Okay. Try and answer them as honestly as I can. This is an exciting thing, I promise! <laughs> Aww, cute. Sure, what's that? Whatever, let's just get this over with. Welcome to the first time user setup for your new relationship and organizational manager running the latest build of Parallax's live intelligence processing system. I'll need to ask you a few questions and then you can get right to managing your life with your new ROM. If you have any questions, feel free to consult our online FAQ and setup guide, or contact our support department directly. First, could you tell me your preferred name for use in account creation, online communications, and conversational speech? Go my first name, so I'm just gonna go. So janky. name yes thank you I have input your name next could you tell me which pronouns I should use for you in referential and conversational speech yeah uh, that. thank you I have input your pronouns Could you tell me your preferred diet for use in restaurant recommendations? What? Uh, I don't... Omnivorous, let me just Google that. Um, because I don't know what any of this means. I think it's like everything, just like not... Yeah, cool. Diet set as omnivorous. Are you sure? Yep. I'm Thank not a vegetarian. You for confirming. I have obtained your physical location from GPS and will load local data into my memory as it becomes available. Please re 
review your submitted profile information for accuracy or restart setup to enter it again. In review, does that sound right? Mm, yeah. Thank you. See, that was relatively painless. You should now mm. also be able to access the local map of Neo SF. Yeah, the meeting with Tomcat isn't until later this evening. Perhaps we should head back to your apartment. I'm sure we can find some common ground while getting to know one another better. It will be an efficient use of our time together. Thank you for escorting me here. Let's head back to your home. It's nice that I don't have to do any voice acting because you know that last time what happened that was horrible. Mhm. Mm I've played too many games at auto save now. I'll probably forget to save and undo all of it by accident. We didn't even make it to chapter one. You know, your Crassula Ovada isn't doing very well. We got a new one. Like a trophy. Have you been overwatering it? My what? This jade plant you have on the windowsill here. Oh, that thing. It's actually a succulent, and since I'm assuming you leave this window open all the time, it should get more than enough water just from the occasional rain blowing in. Speaking of the rain, your decorative plant may be doing poorly, but the mildew in your drywall is flourishing. I have, in fact, already taken the liberty of sending a request to his office. Considering the broken window, broken sink, and the lingering sense of disrepair, I am not confident he has a history of following through. Hmm. I would suggest confronting him in person, but I have run a mesh search, and the man is a convicted felon for assault and battery with a deadly weapon. Oh, lovely. Perhaps we should bring some sort of a bribe? That might be good. I will continue to formulate a stratagem. How thoughtful of them! The Crassula ovata, also known as the Jade Plant, Money Tree, Lucky Tree, or Friendship Tree, is an excellent and easy to care for house plant. Ah, oh, Money Trees. Yeah, so things. I don't know what they look like. They make yeah, beautiful bonsai, are suitable for beginners, and have some cultural significance both in the Far East and America as a token for good financial luck. I'm gonna go get myself one. <laughs> Most likely an urban legend, but still a nice gift. Yeah, I've given a few plants as uh, gifts. Okay. Still, I'll keep an eye on it. It's almost the time Hayden had scheduled to meet with Tomcat. We should make our way to Stardust soon. Your city map is up. Cool. Uh, Stardust Club, let's go. Well, this looks like the place. Assuming the flashing neon signs are telling the truth. From the sounds of the music, things are already underway at Stardust, even so early. Hopefully we can find Tomcat inside. And some answers. Alright. Pop car wreath. Twenty-four-seven. My God. Plant. 
Should we talk to the plant? I'm surprised they're using a human bouncer instead of a ROM. That's a nice, authentic touch. Oh, cute. I really like you. Welcome to Stardust. Can we go in? Hold up there. Got ID? I need to see your ID. Looks good to me. Oh my god, let's just go in. Oh wow, really? Welcome to Stardust. This is the place. Have you ever been here before? No. for your taste, at least from what I know of them. Still, the noise and the crowd should help keep our investigation clandestine. Anyway, where do you think we should start? Well... Good idea. Maybe the bartender can tell us where to find Tomcat. He's a bit of a... Uh... Oh my god, that's terrifying. Morning, friend. What can I do for you? Sounds a bit Russian. Sure, but first, let's get you a drink. <laughs> What'll it be? I don't know any of these. Uh, I just get like a non-alcoholic drink. Guy. So many drinks these days. Remind me, what's in that? Drinkionary, the open alcoholopedia says. Does that sound good? Sounds fine. Ah, all right, you got it. Coming right up. Now, what is it you need to know? I'm pretty sure Tomcat came in earlier, but I don't know where they went off to. I'd ask what you were meeting about, but I know they like to keep that kind of stuff quiet. Yep. Maybe try looking out on the dance floor. If they come around here, I'll tell them you're looking. Hayden. Scientist guy does some kind of computer research at Parallax. Pretty sure I know who you're talking about, but I don't think he's around here tonight. Tonight is Our place morning. doesn't really seem like his scene, but I think he comes in to scout young programming talent. Go figure. I can ask around, find out if anyone's seen him. I'll let you know. Enjoy yourself. And don't be a stranger. Scrapbook. Right. Oh my god. Table. Rad up. I like how we can look at the table. It's kind of cute. Dance Dancers on the flower. Mega Phobia. Okay, cabinet. Mega Fobiter. Only the most go shooting nest. Ghoul blasting nest. Fine, you'll have this side of the bay. Let's use it. Let's have a go!
hard. You died. Did I? Still, though, not a terrible showing for a human without implants. Oh, yeah, I come down. Let's talk to this guy. Hey, what's up? Having a good time. Yeah, I'm sorry, never heard of him. Check your arcade. Alright, let's dance in. Uh, sorry, I'm the wrong person. I was dancing with someone named Tom Kyle a while ago. I don't know what they were now. I just never heard of him. some wicked drinks, by the way. Why would you touch the this guy? Yes, can I help you? Do you know my name Tomcat? I imagine. Huh? Tomcat is Oh wait, I get it. You headed right up to the chick with the ears, cause of course she'd be the one with the cat name. Oh my god. Un freaking believable. Find them yourself, jerk. Is your problem? That was the wrong question. You want to spew that shit? Join the protests outside Genus. I'm sure those ass butts will love you. Genius. Now get lost. Yeah, all right, whatever. Just get moving. Come down, man. Hi there. I heard you were looking for me. Oh? Yours truly, doll. Although, while I, I like the attention, it'd be just grand if you didn't holler for me so loudly. Hold on. I'd do my share of flirting with both sides of the law. Wouldn't want little old me to get in trouble, huh? So, to what do I owe the pleasure? Hayden's missing. Well, it's one way to sour my night. Mm, it's the morning. I already saw you got his little wrong with you, so I'll give you the benefit of the doubt for now. Do you know about me? Hayden never mentioned your involvement. Sure thing, hon. I helped reprogram the back end on your OS so the AI code Hayden wrote for you would work properly with the mesh network. I have a distressing lack of information on my own creation. Oh. Hayden never saw fit to inform me on what went into designing my programming. Maybe because he didn't want you to be self sentient Oh, sentient. Is there anything yeah, else you can tell me? Not much more on that end. I'm a crack shot at making the Lips OS dance to my tune, but Hayden's coding in your AI core is a whole different can of worms. <laughs> Way out of my league. Sorry, doll. Anything else I can help with? Oh, don't you worry about Jess, none. She just don't have a lot of patience when talking to genotypical folks like us. She's had to deal with an awful lot of pricks. Because, uh, it will. Good call. As it suits you, hon. I like it. Hayden and I met not long after my blackout expired, when he recruited me for my expertise in lips. It puzzled me at the time, since he's very sharp himself. I mean, he, he could have done the job blindfolded and boozy. I think he just wanted someone working on out the books. 
He ain't the most uh, straightforward kind of man. Oh, it's a powerful OS. And it's since been adapted to run on ROMs after they figured out how much more efficient it is. It's focused on learning algorithms, so it can tailor itself to each user's habits. And it functions through using a distributed mesh network for non-essential public files. Huh. My mama would have sudsed your tongue for that. Don't be so rude! Besides, I could understand them just fine! Why couldn't you? I'm sorry. Nah, nah, fella. I'll amuse your friend here. That's just a fancy way of saying all ROMs connect to all other ROMs. Within range. And they share all files the user has tagged as private. It's handy in dense population areas like Neo XF since it can bypass regular telecom nodes to access the internet. Out in the sticks, though, you're stuck connecting to regular old pops. <laughs> yeah. Disappearance has something to do with me, based on his recent behavior. Well, let's see. Uh, Hayden was pretty hush hush about his work on your creation, but a parallax found out about it somehow. Ooh, that might have changed things. It ain't always so good for a big company when their leading product declares independence. <laughs> I'm certain Hayden had some kind of intellectual property clause written into his contract with him, but... He would just get fired. Maybe even sued. I, I can't imagine they would disappear him. I mean, they ain't the CIA or anything. Yeah, I'm not real sure, huh? But it would likely help if we knew why he went missing in the first place. I'll stay here and ask around a bit. People know me, and they sure ain't gonna talk to a newbie like yourself. Fine. Why don't you hop back over to Hayden's place and grab the data cache out of his computer for me? Sure. We can go over his research notes and see if we can't find a reason for his being banished. If Parallax is involved, there's probably something we're not seeing. Best to get all the clues we can find. The data cache would be the best place to start. Good luck. Perrin, you you keep out of trouble. Let's leave. Didn't really want my drink anyway, you know. Right. Uh, home, Stardust Club, or Hayden's apartment. Halt, citizen. This area has been cordoned off by the Neo SF Police Department as part of an ongoing investigation. I apologize for the inconvenience, but I am not authorized to allow anyone to enter this location. You sure? I'm sorry, citizen, but I cannot give comment on any currently ongoing investigations. If you would like to leave your contact information with me, I can forward your inquiry to the detective in charge, who will get in touch with you as soon as it is feasible. No, they may have questions for you. Thank you in advance for your cooperation, citizen. That will not be possible, citizen. The area must be preserved in pristine condition for the collection of evidence. Only authorized Neo SFPD personnel may enter. I am required by law to inform you that I am set at level 2 guard mode, and any effort to make unauthorized entry will be met with non-lethal force sufficient to incapacitate. Calm down, you bane impression. I apologize, but I must ask you to move along. Loitering around an active investigation area is prohibited by city statute, 
and I am authorized to issue the citation of a fine to any persons found to be doing so. We should go ahead and get moving. Mm. Oh, brat, I did not expect the police to get involved so quickly. The situation is already growing out of our control. I suppose we don't have to hide the fact of Hayden being missing anymore, but we do have to move faster. Do you have any ideas on how to get in there and grab that data cache? Yep. What would that be? Please, sir. I found no such connection when I compiled your personal history. Give me a moment. Oh, I see now. Detective Lexi Rivers. She used to date your sister. Well, I must have missed that link in your history somehow. You have a very poor net presence. That's me. It makes anticipating your needs more difficult. Yeah. Well, setting aside your unreasonable distaste for technology, I agree with your suggestion. Her online profile suggests that she might be willing to work with us off the books, so to speak. A considerable boon, since I would prefer to maintain Great. the clandestine nature of this investigation for now. Let us go and find Miss Rivers to request assistance. Oh, right. Should I refresh my protocols for handling titles around Detective Rivers? Yes. Yes, you should. I... I don't even have any teeth. <clears throat> I mean, done and done. We wouldn't want any social faux pas, would we? Now lead the way. Nice. Anyway... Once we get to the police station, I think that's a pretty good place to leave it there. Uh, we'll get to the police station actually and just say that. Oh my god, get There we go. Anyway, thank you for watching this brilliant new game. So nice to play. I love the um, old sort of graphic vibes. So good. Nice. So good. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it here. If you want to, comment, like, and subscribe. You don't have to. Don't forget to be awesome. And see you later. Goodbye.